Hello everybody and welcome back. We are back on my monk. And we are going to be taking a look at another of the artifact weapon quests for the monk. I have switched over to the Mistweaver spec as we will be pursuing the one for the healing spec of the monk, the Mistweaver. One of my personal favorite healing specs in the game. I should address a couple of things about this. Uh, she is level 28. And they've also made some interesting changes to the Mistweaver. So, how many of you, of course, are familiar with the statue that you can be able to place? The Jade Serpent Statue to be able to increase your healing on a certain single target. Now, I sometimes had a tendency to pass up on this. Actually, most of the time, I personally didn't use this because I liked going with Chi G because I liked having a big cooldown where he just ran around, kept healing anybody who needed health. However, to help fix this, Blizzard decided to basically give us a version of both, if we wanted it to. They have actually now added a baseline talent uh, ability for the Mistweaver called Invoke Yulan, the Jade Serpent, which basically does the same thing that Chi Ji did. Taking Chi Ji now basically makes it where he heals if you do other, you know, attack abilities. But if you want now, you can basically have both Yulan and the statue, which, yeah, I like that. I tried it out on my other monk uh, when I queued, up, queued him up as a Mistweaver in order to pursue getting the Horseman's Mount. And, uh, yeah, it was, I liked how it felt having both of those. That was pretty nice. So yeah, this is some of the stuff. They actually took, I had Manatee earlier. It's gone now. <laughs> it will be available again at level 30. So anyways, let's go, I'm gonna go ahead and put that back there. There we go. So I've gone ahead and equipped a staff for Intel and we're gonna be going after the Mistweaver artifact. We have searched through our scrolls and have found new leads on a couple of powerful weapons. They may prove beneficial in our efforts. Here, let me show you what I have found. If any of these interest you, then simply let me know. Evil cannot take root. Long ago, the last Pandaren Emperor used his staff, Shailun, to shroud all of Pandaria in mists. The staff has remained at the Terrace of Eternal Spring for generations. When the Legion attacked Pandaria, Shadowpan defenders rushed to secure the area. They haven't reported back, and we fear the worst. The staff must not fall into the wrong hands. Before I continue this, though, I just realized, let me, uh, change up. Yeah, there we go. That kind of helps me. We are a force of balance in a chaotic ocean. Ah, Shailun, the legendary staff wielded by our last emperor. If the Legion were to acquire this weapon, they could unleash untold horrors across the whole of the continent. They must be stopped. If you want to get to the terrace as fast as possible, you should hitch a ride directly to the mainland. Tak Tak, a Hosen Kite Master, is skulking around west of the temple. Speak to him without delay. We will not rest until the Legion is defeated. Tak Tak's pretty cool. Then again, a number of the Hosen were pretty cool characters. What the ook and ook? And of course, there's Lil Walker Cho. Where are we going? Can you take me to the Terrace of Eternal Spring, Tuck Tuck? We done. Okie doke. Ignore the Okey -doke. option about the TN Monster. Area. This place smells like turtle anyways. <laughs> Pandaria looking real bad. Ain't seen this much germ jabbing since that big orc guy duked up the veil. It's one of the only times we get to fly above the Wandering Isle. Since we can't really fly here. Here we are. Oh, uh, wait. them wob gobblers done took this place. Yeah, that's not good. 
Oh, that's also not good. I put you White feather. Tech Tech do what he do best. Nothing. <laughs> Gee, thanks, Tech Tech. <gasps> Terran Zoo. Bless the crane, a healer. I got gotcha. you. The leader knows the importance. Thank you, hero. The sacred waters have already been corrupted. If you help me rescue the others, we may be able to reclaim this place. I will need your healing powers, champion. I cannot face this demon alone. Don't worry, Terran Zoo. I got your back. If your legion wants Pandaria, you will have to get through us. Let's get some help out of here, shall we? I won't let you down. Let's get ourselves a full-on group here. So we've got Fei Li out. Now Softfoot. I am right. Oh, hey, it's Neuron. How she? I'm with you. Let's do this. Wow. Essence font. Be gone, beast. Your shameful crusade ends here. Boy, this is weird not having some of my bigger cooldowns that I would have later on. Come, that monster has already spread his corruption to the waters above. We must act quickly. So this is a healer quest, and I love this quest. We must work together. Champion, we will follow your lead. How do you wish to deploy the Shadow Pan? This is awesome. We now get to customize how we want this party to function in this battle. This is almost, this is basically like us getting to have an NPC dungeon group and determine how we want them to operate as we go through the dungeon. I love this. Like, look at this. I can be able to go over here and talk to... Uh, you're wrong. Welcome. Hello, monk. It is good to have a healer at our side. We are the Shadow Pan, the last defense of Pandaria. I am Hawkmaster Nurong, master of the Wu Kao discipline. We are the eyes of the Shadow Pan, the scouts who make our enemies fear the darkness. Now to business. I will assault Asperius at range while my hawk Whitefeather swoops in to harass him with beak and claw. Stand near me and I will help you attack faster. That's the aura he has on him right now, which is damage dealt is increased by 50% and melee range and casting speeds is increased by 50%. I could go in for an all-out attack, but it would put myself at risk. How aggressive should I be? So I can be able to tell him, you know, either concentrate on keeping yourself alive, fight defensively, or do as much damage as you can. Even if it puts you at risk, I will keep you alive. Ready when you are. Taoshi. You have my attention. Thank you for your well-timed rescue, monk. We could have used your help in the Pandaren campaign. My name is Taoshi, the silent blade of the Shadow Pan. I slip unseen through enemy territory and strike where they are weakest. I'll do my part while Terran Zhu holds that thing's attention. I will stalk it from behind and bury my daggers in any weak spots. 
I can also help you move around quickly, quickly around the battlefield. Stand near me to gain charges of your role, cheat torpedo, and missed walk abilities. Yep. How aggressive do you want me to be? I could throw caution to the wind and wage an all-out assault, but I'll need to know that you have my back. Don't hold back, Taoshi. Do your worst. I have trained my entire life for this. Faye the firecracker. She was a bit of a pyromaniac back in Pandaria, and she still is, as you will hear in just a moment. Ha! I'm all fired up. Thank you, Monk, for coming to our aid. I am Fei Li, and I have a reputation among the Shadow Pan for setting things on fire. Usually our enemies. Sometimes our monastery. Lord Terran Zhu isn't too pleased with me at the moment. Help me get back into his good graces if you can keep me on my feet. I will be able to break Asperius's ice walls and otherwise bring him to a boil. Stand near me and my brilliance aura will restore your mana. Yep, restores 5% of my mana to nearby allies per second. She grins savagely. So do you want me to really like this thing up or should I concentrate on keeping myself alive? No, do your worst, Faley. Let's light them up. <laughs> The Shadow Pan welcome you. Your plan is solid, Pandanix. Of course, our success depends on your ability to keep us all alive. Of course, you gotta put it all on the healer. For my part, I will try to hold the creature's attention and absorb the brunt of its fury. Let me know when you are ready, and I will give the order to begin the assault. I love that we are basically conferring with the tank of the group, uh, you know, to, you know, about, uh, you know, to let him know, all right, we're ready to go. Our fellowship. The healer is letting the tank know it's okay. I'm full on mana. Let's go. Burn, baby. Burn. See? Burn, baby. Burn. Do I? Oh, that's right. Detox. That's right. For a moment, I forgot what my cleanse was on a, on a Mistweaver. I was like, wait, what, what? Which one is it? Oh, that's right. It's that one. Yeah, I am not doing all that well. I'm a little rusty. But I'm also missing some abilities. It's alright. We got it. It is done! You have done a great service for Pandaria. There it is. The staff of our last Emperor. You have proven yourself worthy to wield it, friend of the Shadow Pan. I appreciate that. Ah, ten thousand years ago, Emperor Shaohao used that very staff to cloak our land in a veil of mists, hiding us from the burning legion. But this time, the Pandaren will not hide away. We choose to fight! Turn the Emperor's staff against the legion, champion. We will be right behind you. Thanks for the backing. Tack tack. Let's head back. How's it juking? Who can cook? You got the Emperor's staff. Does that make you like the Emperor now? 
That makes me like the Monkey King. He does a little dance. Let's get back to the Wandering Isle. Your Majesty. Bye bye. Don't worry, we'll be seeing the real Monkey King when we go after the Brewmaster one. My friend, may the White Tiger bless your campaign against our foes. Thanks, Terenzu. I'll see you later. No, seriously, like, he'll be a part of the, uh, monk campaign. Gah. Such a shame that even basic stuff like that is coming up as an error. <laughs> uh, I really hope some of this stuff gets fixed by the time we get to the actual expansion. Let's patch up this sucker. If you encounter bugs or such, report them so Blizz can fix them. Thanks, Tac Tac. I'll probably be seeing you real soon. You are a beacon of light in the darkness. Incredible. The very staff that the Emperor used to cloud to cloak Pandaria in mist all those years ago. Treat that staff well. It will save your life and probably the lives of all of your friends as well. We have searched and found a lead upon another artifact that you might find helpful. We so we'll be going after that one in a separate video. The, the Fuzan, the staff for the Brewmaster. So, in the meantime... Oh, where am I going? It's right here. In the meantime... For Shailun... So we've got the you know, default appearance here. We've got the upgrade appearance there. Kind of stuff around the bell there. Color tints there. The balance of power one basically adds a you know a look here that makes it look like Chi G is kind of you know part of the the you know the main part of the staff there. I think it actually looks pretty cool. Of course, you can change the color. The PvP appearance is more play on the Shaw. Takes on a more Shaw-like appearance. Here's a more close-up look if you want to see. There you go. And as far as the secret appearance, I do have it. And I will show it to you. Go ahead and uh, go here and I'll equip it. So the secret appearance is this one right here. May your feet find Has a kind of a, a play on dragons. That's because in order to get this, you have to get it to drop from the Dragons of Nightmare in the Emerald Nightmare Raid. This specific boss is the one that drops uh, this secret appearance. So, you can take your Mistweaver to the Emerald Nightmare Raid, go to that boss, and have a shot at this dropping. It did take me several attempts, but it, I did finally get it. So, that is the artifact weapon for the Mistweaver. So when we return to our monk, we will be going after Fuzan for the Brewmaster, the tank spec. Uh, we'll see how I do, as uh, that's the one that I tend to struggle with the most. But I'm hoping to get better going forward. Stay tuned.